Windy's seal-thrilling win for series whitewash beat Bangladesh by 17 runs despite Mahedi's late resistance in the second test in Dhaka Taman Iqbal's brisk 50 gave Bangladesh hope, but his dismissal brought in a massive collapse on the fourth day of the Dhaka test on Sunday. Photo, Firoz Ahmed Star Online report West Indies have recorded a thrilling 17-run victory over Bangladesh on extended final session of the fourth day of the Dhaka test to complete a 2-0 whitewash of the hosts. Why first innings 409? Ban first innings 296? Why second innings 117 all out? Ban second innings, 213 all out in 61.3 overs, Taman 50 Miraz 31, Mominal 25, Cornwall 3 to 105, Warrican 3 to 47, Braithwaite 3 to 25, Rakeem Cornwall took four wickets while Jomal Warrican and Craig Braithwaite took two each as the hosts were bundled out for 213 in 61.3 overs in chase of 231. All-rounder Mahedi Hassan Miraz had given the host slim hopes of an unlikely win and a series draw with a dog 31, but his dismissal by Warrican, an excellent catch by Cornwall, who took nine wickets in the match, meant the visitors claimed their first 2-0 series win in Asia since 2012. And when considering the lineup of the team following pulling out of some big names over Covid conses, this series victory is all the more glorious for the men from Caribbean islands. Myraz's dismissal brought an end to a day which ebbed and flowed, with 17 wickets falling. After bowling out West Indies for 117 runs in their second essay and picking a quick 50, Bangladesh looked within a shout of a record successful run chase at the Sher e Bangla National Stadium. But Taman Iqbal's dismissal for a 48 ball 50 started the collapse before Myraz's counterpunch had briefly reignited the fading hopes of the hosts. T. Bangladesh lose Shanto for 11. Taman Iqbal led the charge with a 48-ball 50 as Bangladesh shaved off one-fourth of the target before wickets started tumbling. Somia Sarkar, who was rather sedate compared to Taman, was dismissed by West Indies skipper Craig Braithwaite for a 34-ball 13 as Bangladesh lost their first wicket for 59. Taman followed Somia shortly after bringing up his 50, he too falling to the part-time off-spinner. Nazmul Hussain Shanto was the third to fall, departing at the stroke of T off the bowling of Rakeem Cornwall as skipper Mominal Hack will be joined by Mushfika Rahim after T to negotiate the last session of play. Bangladesh are still 153 runs adrift of the target with seven wickets in hand. Post-lunch, West Indies were bowled out for 117 runs in 52.5 overs in their second innings of the Dhaka Test with a 231-run target for Bangladesh with a day and a half still left. Having started the day at 41 for 3, the visitors lost three wickets in the morning session adding 57 runs. However, a collapse right after the lunch break, exacerbated by sharp turn and bounce, saw the visitors lose their last four wickets for 10 runs. Left-arm spinner Tajul Islam took four wickets while right-arm spinner Naeem Hassan took three wickets. They finished on 117 for an overall lead of 231 runs. Bangladesh all time on their hand but they will have to create some sort of history to overhaul the target and force a series draw after having lost the first match in Chattagram. Mushfika Rahim takes a tumbling catch at deep extra cover to end West Indies' second innings of the Dhaka Test on Sunday. Photo Firoz Ahmed the highest successful fourth innings chase at the Sher e Bangla National Stadium is 209 runs. News taken from the Daily Star. Please subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching.